Good morning, ladies and gents. Guess get back to a, another kind of random PS2 game that I've never played before. I've never even heard of it before, to be honest. It's called Pilot Down Behind Enemy Lines. As you can see, it's. I thought it would be a blue disc, old old school blue disc one, but it's not. It's it's, it's um, 2005. So I mean, that's yeah. I'd have been I'd have been at uni at the time. Hang on. Uh, it's a bit too loud. It's a bit too loud. So I've no idea what we've got to do with this. I'm assuming it's going to be like that. What was it called? Prisoner, I think there was one called something like Prisoner of War, where you had to, like, great escape it. You had to Steve McQueen it. Oh. Okay, so we've got some facts there. 5,000 braved enemy territory to attempt to reach the free world. Only 300. Wow. Neutral Switzerland. My journey is about to begin. I think you start in a plane, and then you get shot down, and you got to go from there. Oh. 1943. 3,000 feet somewhere near Frankfurt. The American B-24 Liberator. Liberty Bell. Captain Tom Woods. Oh, I've got to press this. Uh, bogey at five o'clock, coming in fast. Joe has been hit without our ring gunner, we're a sitting duck. I quite like this kind of comic book style thing, I quite like it. Uh, get back there and man that gun, I'll keep this crate in the air. Foster, we're about 90 seconds from target. We're even go Oh, it's like one of those, um, oh, what are they called? Like that, they did it for Silent Hill. <clears throat> Excuse me, they had like a, what do they call it, a narrative experience or something like that, anyway. 90 seconds from target, Lieutenant William Foster. Or left handed for the Fosco co pilot. Get this guy off my ass. Nice. I do like the art style here, I like it. It's a very simple colour palette, but it's quite effective. Nice. He's still coming! I've hit him, but he's still coming. Oh god, he's on fire. Oh, I see. So he sort of kamikaze into the bomber. We're hit. We've lost a wing. Everybody bail out. Going down. I repeat, what? We're going down. Zzzk. Now that's interesting because on the back of the box there's pictures definitely in which you are piloting. Holy smokes! Talk about throwing you in at the deep end. Use the left, use the left analog stick. Oh, look at that! It's got that. It's a bit like oh. I'm sure it'll be fine. It's got a slightly cell shaded e borderlandsy look about it. Wow! Hang on. No, I need to invert those if I can. If I can, invert y axis. What? What? Hang on. What? Oh, okay. That was weird. It was already... Okay, it was the other way around when I first went into the menu, and then it... And then it kind of wasn't. Anyway, use left analog stick to move fast. There's our shoot. Oh, what else does it... Oh, it's got a slightly Fable visual quality about it. The way you run this reminds me a bit of Fable. Uh, use the right button to adjust the camera. Well, yeah. I kind of figured... I'm glad we're getting a tutorial, though. A lot of these old school PS2 games, and nice, it's got familiar controls. Wow, it's very slow. Um, just sort of had the attitude of, oh, well, you've probably read the manual. We don't need to bother giving you a tutorial. The red bar displays current level of health. Use first aid pack. I haven't got a first aid pack, have I? All right. Can I grab stuff? Oh, to interact with objects, hold down. Oh, to enter the action menu, press up and down, and then release. Oh, it's like Hitman, the old school Hitman controls. Like on PS2. Speaking of which, I really need to finish contracts. I've got about three missions on that to do. I just need to finish that. I don't really want to... What else have we got? I don't really want to use a med kit at the moment. Do you know, this is considerably better and more fleshed out and rounded than I was expecting. Private... What? I can't read that. Why can I not read that bottom word? Yugged. I can't read what that says. Anyway, I don't know why I can't read that. Blue bar shows the current endurance level. Hunger, bad... Oh no, there's an endurance bar. Bad weather. Moving through icy water will cause it to drop. Can I sprint? No. I've got to go through here though, haven't I? Okay, does that go back up again when I leave the water? No, of course it doesn't. Oh, health will be lost until endurance is reached. So, campfires, let me guess. Light fires, nice. Oh, it's like outward. Well, it's not like outward at all, but anyway. Eating food will also restore lost endurance. Cook food whenever possible, as this will have an improved effect. But, you know, this is, this is quite... I mean, it's going down the, the survival route quite uh, quite heavily, isn't it? Can I get up there? No. Yeah, lighting fires, cooking food. I like it. I, actually, I'm, I'm very impressed with this, compared to what I was expecting. It may go very much downhill when combat begins, but and I'm assuming it's going to be quite stealth-based. But you see, there's definitely a, a shot. Uh oh. Civilians do not pose a direct threat, but some may attempt to interfere. Oh. To interfere with nearby soldiers, that's not right. He's got an outhouse. Can I, like, 
knock him out but without actually hurting him. Okay, it hasn't told me to, to be stealth. Oh, we're over Frankfurt. Oh, I was going to say, why is he help, why is he not helping? It's locked from the other side. Locked from the other side. It's locked from the other side. Do I have to climb over? Can I climb over? I can't go in windows, can I? Nope. It's a very slow crouch. I hate. I mean, it's realistic, but I do hate games that have really slow crouches. Oh, back up against the wall. Stand here and press the. Okay. Oh, is this good? A yellow bar appears. If you're completely angry, become curious and investigate. Okay, so he's going to unlock it, but then what? Do I have to knock him out? He's definitely going to see me. A red bar of pills. Oh, he seek cover. Okay, so some of them just... He just ran into the toilet. I don't blame him. But he may well tell people that I'm here. Okay, well, that's interesting. So, again, he's got another similar uh, attitude or aspect to... Can I actually see him in there? Oh, did I see a foot? Or is that the base of the toilet? No, he's just vanished. He's gone in there and he's disappeared. <laughs> it's a TARDIS toilet. Um, let's have a peek. Yeah, I wonder if I can actually... Um, I didn't actually close it, did I? Um, yeah, I don't know if I can actually KO people without alerting them. Oh, nice, got a pickaxe. Pick up pickaxe. Can I look in here? I can't. Oh, there's an orange thing. It's got to be good. How do I get that? Let me get the orange thing. Secret item. Not really that secret, in all fairness. Pick up rabbit. Oh, because I can cook it. Yeah, of course. Three secret items hidden on each level. Do you know, as I say, I'm enjoying this a lot more than I was expecting. What's the pickaxe for? I'll come and kill you with a pickaxe. Um, do I go back and, and cook that rabbit? Was there something I needed to pickaxe my way through? I don't remember seeing anything, but there might have been. Um, okay, well, anyway, we'll cook this to begin with. Proper Breath of the Wild style. Cook food. Have I done it? Use cooked rabbit. How do I? Okay. I don't really want to go back through that water, but maybe I have to. Um. Oh. Uh. What? Well, I could. What? Yeah. Oh, use the pickaxe on the on the rock head. I thought it was on the wing of the plane. I thought, is that gonna is that gonna help? Oh, nice. And it had enough common sense. Hello, bugs. It had enough common sense to just suggest that. Nice to crawl under it, and then crawl under rocks. Yeah, so it's got a lot of context-sensitive actions. I like that. Instead of having to go into particular menus and guff like that, crawl out. Nice. My health is a little bit down. I don't remember it asking what difficulty to play this on, but... And I know th Uh-oh. Oh, no! Looks like I was lucky. He didn't even make it to the ground. Okay, how do... Whoa. Moving around creates noise. Sneak around quietly. Move while crouched. Well, yeah. Can I... Can I sneak up and, like, KO him? Headlock him? Oh, hang on. Sneak up behind him. Hold the R1. Hold it and then press X to strangle the enemy. Okay. I'm pressing R1. I'm dangerously close to him. Sneak up behind him. When the icon appears... What icon? What? Oh my god, how close have you got to be? Oh, tap it. Okay. <gasps> to strangle the enemy. Right, drag bodies out of sight. Okay, I drag him behind that rock. I'm moving to the left. Hand Again, he's got like aspect. Look at this. Aspects of tension and stuff going on here. Hiding corpses. This is going to turn into an all-out gunfight before you know it, though. It always starts off well. Starts with good intentions. Flump. Is that behind the... I don't know if it's behind the... Apparently I can't move it anymore. Yeah. Nice. I'm obviously going to have to shoot this next dude, aren't I? Oh, here he comes. Uh-oh. 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 
I'll try and get behind him and not. Uh oh. I have a worrying feeling this isn't going to work. But anyway, we'll see. It's going to make a lot of racket, isn't it? Oh, seven rounds and two magazines. Here he comes. Am I behind? Am I behind cover? Because he looks like he's got. Uh oh. Oh, there's. Oh no, it's rocks. I was going to say there's more ammo there. Uh oh. I forgot whether it was R1 or L1. Nope. <sighs> okay, that was a bit loud. We'd fight the enemy back up against objects to take cover. But yeah, we didn't. We didn't do any of that. I tried to. I couldn't remember whether it told me. I'm not going to reload because I got feeling I'm going to lose. I lose any rounds there. Um, I couldn't remember whether it was L1 or R1 that, that was like initiate the choke. But maybe you can only do that when you haven't got any. Um, when you haven't got a weapon equipped, which would make sense. But anyway. Putter sense. At least it's one of those. Uh oh. At least it's one of those games where. Look at that. I like it. Was that a Aurora Borealis or was that a bombing run? Or Aurora Australis? Uh, Australis. Yeah, I was glad that they did not bullet sponge enemies. Literally one shot and he was he was deaded. I wonder what their line of sight is. Didn't seem to actually be able to hear the... Uh oh. Damn it. This dude hasn't seen or heard anything. Ow. Damn it. Oh! Uh oh. Ow! Okay, he only took a couple of shots. The other one didn't seem to let me... Well, I'm not quite convinced about the enemy AI in this. Oh, he is actually hiding behind cover. I thought he was just standing there as though he'd forgotten what he was doing. There's no way that's going to let me... I wish it would change colour to indicate that... Um, you know, that you are about to hit them. You can move while aiming. I didn't think you could. I'm going to try and outfox him. Look at this. He has no idea what's coming up. I don't know how to reload, but I also don't want to because I've got to figure out to lose what's left in the, in the clip. Nice. Well, that's really annoying that I don't get to take his, the weapons. Unless... I don't want to drop it. Can you unequip it? No, apparently not. Okay. I mean, it seems a little bit stingy with the ammo, but anyway. Nice, I get a, a woodsman's axe. that would do. Axe in the back of the head. Even better than a bullet. That's weird that it won't let me... Oh, hang on. Hang on a minute. Nearly missed this. And there's a secret. I have no idea how you get to it. Oh, pick up apple. Okay. Can I eat a, a apple? Use apple. Oh no, that does for endurance. That doesn't do for. Ah, oh, it's the other one. I don't know if I want to bother wading through there to get that secret. Because it's going to knacker my endurance. Oh, we have we have options, Moggy. Careful. Okay, sorry about that. Sorry, Moggy. Moggy decided to get involved, wanting fed. Now we have options. Looks like we got like a, a way up there, and a way there. See, I've been playing quite a lot of Sniper Elite three and four again recently. Again. Oh, hidden objectives. Will allow the allied ah to aid the allied warrior. Anyway, and this sort of got me in a oh, I got to be really careful with ammo here. I got almost it's none. Pretty bad, but the Germans will salvage what they can. Maybe I can prevent that. Right. I mean, uh oh, I don't seem to be able to do that. That like strangling them thing. Now that I've got this this pistol. Pick up cigarettes. Cigarettes will cause sold. Oh. oh, no. Run away. Ow, ow, gonna die. Gonna die. Oh, no. <laughs> the other dude turned around. Where's he gonna put me? Is he gonna put me literally all the way back to the other bit? Please don't. 
please. Oh no, I think it is. Was I supposed to save? If so, then I'll just edit out this first bit, because I know where I'm going. I'll go back up to that little bit there. I should take no chances this time. If it is, if it is, if it has put me all the way back. I bet it has. Yep. God damn it. Oh well. Okay, and we're back. Um, finally got back to this bit. I'm actually doing a bit better in terms of ammunition and health. I've used a health pack though. Actually managed to KO somebody without having to... Um... Nice! Officer down! Um, without having to use any ammo that I did before. So I'm doing slightly better in terms of resources wise. It's really annoying that you can't search them for stuff. There's a packet of cigarettes on here. I forgot what it said about cigarettes. There's also, I think, there's a dude on the other side. Cigarettes will cause soldiers to stop and investigate when dropped within their line of sight. Using cigarettes to distract them, okay, from their patrol routes. I think there's another one. Yeah, there's one more over here. I think this is an optional bit. Okay, he looks like he's just going to stay where he is. Oh, can I get over this? Okay, we're going to try and work our way around, flank him. Okay, we'll see. This may take a bit of time because the... Uh, the crouching is not particularly speedy, but then that's kind of fair enough. Oh, this is the plane. Obviously, I've just realised this is the plane that we saw come crashing down a minute ago, isn't it? See, continuity. I'm hoping he's the last dude. Yeah, the AI, the AI on this is more than a bit squiffy. Um, I don't know. We'll see. But he, uh, yeah, one of the other guys. He was just like blatantly standing in front of him. I, I, this wasn't. This is not in the recording. But he's standing on the other side of these logs. Oh. Nice. I've got to do this carefully because it is possible to get up behind them and not have to shoot them. I bet there's something over there. Look at this master of stealth. This could go horribly wrong. Come on! There we go. Nice. Again, there's, I can't believe they don't drop anything. Obviously the game is trying to promote a sense of stealth really over over just running about going ham. What's this? Interact. Pretty bad. But the Germans will salvage what they can. Maybe I can prevent that. She's busted up pretty bad. But the Germans How do I how do I prevent that? Oh, what's this? Pick up incendiary device. Okay. Am I supposed to Am I supposed to put an incendiary device down on here? I'm gonna catch light. I'd better get clear. Run away! What is it that he's blowing up? So long, Liberty Bell. At least the Germans won't get their hands on you. Oh, okay. He's literally just okay. Second, prevent salvage of Allied bombers. He's literally just setting fire to the entire plane. Fair enough. I would have thought there might be something I could take from there. Oh yeah. After you've done a stealth kill, I've noticed by the way, note that you um unequip that, which is not overly helpful to be honest. I don't quite know why doing a stealth kill cancels that but anyway it does it does I'm not going to do a huge amount of this but we'll, we'll see how far we get I still haven't hit a checkpoint as far as I can see unless that counts as one that footpath into the forest looks like my best chance of escape sneak through the enemy encampment yeah we know what's going to happen here don't we <gasps> I see a half track I mean, is it is it going to fail me if I don't sneak? Oh, there's something in there. Apples. I'm not sure if apples are health or endurance. Granny Smiths. Uh, right, we'll turn around here. Nope. I wonder if they're potentially explosive, possibly. Pick up apple, pick up apple. Flare. Flares will explode a short time after use, causing nearby soldiers to come and investigate. Okay. Is there something over there? Yeah, there's something over there. Again, not quite sure what his line of sight is. Is that ammo? Yeah. Don't carry anymore. Oh no! What? Hang on. Let me just see. Why? I've got two more spaces. Why? Can you only carry one? Oh, it's because of the weight. 
No, that does endurance. Okay, that's annoying. How much does that weigh? Ah, oh, what if I have another apple? No, it's too much. Damn it! Um, what could I drop? Hang on, we might we might come back for that. Okay, this is this is going to erupt into a gunfight. Clearly, I'm very worried about them shooting the barrels next to me, but. It does look like there's only two of them. And do I throw the flares? Let's see what happens if I try using a flare. I mean, <laughs> are you? Uh oh. Why did it explode at the end? Do flares explode? No, he didn't even hear that. He didn't even care. Didn't even care. Never mind. Okay, well, this is all about lives and nerds. Well, we know where the other secrets are. We've got all three secrets. Well, we haven't got, but we saw all three secrets for the level. Marginally annoying that we didn't pick them all up. But I just I didn't do want to wade through that that water. So only medkits are good for health. I could do with getting the one on the left first, because he's, he's more... What I might do, I might try using the other flare. Then I might be able to pop this dude. There we go. Nice. Are they both coming over, or just the one? Is that what was that? No, the other guy doesn't. Couldn't care less. If the other guy couldn't even hear that, then possibly I could shoot this guy without the other one. Oh, he's, he's literally wandering. Oh, you turd! And the other guy didn't hear, that's fine, that's good. Somehow. Gunfire in the middle of a silent night, but you know, just ignore it. It's just rabbits. Rabbits and foxes having a gunfight. Um. Not sure how good his hearing is either. Okay. Again, is there somebody actually in that half track over there? If so, this could be this could be an issue. This game is—I've got to say—this game has got legs. Hello, Mogs. This game has definite potential. Um. Oh. What was that? His suspicion obviously went. Oh, was that health bar? It might have been a health bar. Again, the great thing with Sniper Elite is you can just like run away and start pegging people from a distance and you, they, they never really get up to you in time, unless there's another Sniper and then you have issues. Anyway, see if when this guy wanders off. Is there a dude in that? I really hope not. Uh -oh. Come on! You're like fractionally faster than their walking speed when you're crouching. Come on! Nice! Nice! Come on! There we go! Oh, nice. Yeah, I don't think there's anyone in there. Blech. Nice! I can't be bothered to carry him away. And as I say, I'm pretty sure there's only the two of them. Another medkit! That's hard. Pick it up! Oh, I really wish I'd gone back for the other one now. <laughs> oh, your, your endurance just drops anyway. I really want to shoot those barrels, see if I can blow up the half track. No, we're going to leave it, we're going to leave it. Look at this tiny tent. Look at this. It's not going to get one person in there. Okay, so we've got ourselves into the woods. Do I sh sh Oh, hang on, hang on, hang on. Wait a second. I wonder. Okay, hang on. I just want to see if I can go get that other pistol or not. It's really brutal that your endurance just goes down just just for being about. Yeah. And then you got to be near a nice warm, toasty fire to get it back up again. Oh. Morphine will reduce the amount of damage. Okay. Oh. I just want to get to the other side, basically. That's cool that you can do that, though. 
So I didn't have to go all the way around. It probably would have been quicker to go all the way around, but anyway, it doesn't matter. Yeah, we actually got it. We're probably on like full. Yep, 100 out of 100. Um. Yeah, there we go. Okay, because it might not be regenerating health between levels. Not that we're going to play another level. This was just a little taste. I don't know. I might do one more. I know I say that on a lot of my videos. I might do another another one of these, and then never end up doing it. There's so many things to play, but this wasn't bad at all. To be honest, I played a lot worse. Like back in the day, I would have probably quite enjoyed this. And Ice is one of those styles, a country style to cross over. Primary objective, secondary objective, secret items. Damn it. One thousand. Okay. Oh, I'm not sure I've got the right memory card in here, I've just realised. Anyway, uh, oh, you can buy stuff. Oh, improves pistol accuracy. Improves stealth kill efficiency. Maximum health, yeah, we could do some of that. Um, uh, oh, I ain't got enough for anything else, or have I? Oh, no, I have, I could do one more. What does that do? Carrying capacity? No. Increases effective first aid kit, maybe? Resistance to cold and hunger? Hmm. Yeah, go on, we'll chat that one up as well. Any remaining screwed? Okay, yeah, it's fine. Well, how do I... Oh, I didn't see the yes-no option at the bottom. I would like to save my game, but I don't know if I've got any room for it. Oh, okay, that's fine. I did clear out the memory card, but I thought it might be the PS1 in there. Anyway, well, that was a little taster of Pilot... What's it called? Pilot Down... Something or other. Pilot Down Behind Enemy Lines. I'll see if there's an intro clip to the next little bit. I guess I might do a little bit more of it, because it had appealing qualities. Choose your battles wisely. When you find yourself hopelessly outnumbered, it is better to run away than stand and fight. We've got more health, and we're not so fussed about the cold anymore. We've got our thermal pants on from now on, so that will probably help. See, I've also been playing a bit of bolt action recently, so this kind of fits in with that as well. A nearby airfield. Brig. Yes? When? Where? Where did it go down? I understand. Some work for us, Captain? Perhaps. Perhaps. Call out your dogs, Otto. We leave immediately. Oh, it's them! Okay. I should have been doing a silly LOLO style accent, really. Look at that! Oh, that's so cheeky, though, that our health bar is bigger, but it didn't actually... Uh -oh. uh, it didn't actually um, fill it for us, which you kind of would have expected. I might just kill this dude and then leave it there. I just kind of want to get one more kill in. Or get murdered. But anyway, we have saved, so it's not the end of the world if it all goes wrong. Careful, Moggy. Eek, he's getting a bit close. I think he may well see me in a minute. He didn't, somehow. Okay, in that case, let's try and go for the stealthy option. It's really difficult when they're walking, though. I think you, have, I think you can only do it when they're standing still. Come on. There we go. And there is a way of, of getting that down a bit more. I think of like speeding up the that. Okay, so we know we can do that next time if we do uh, if we do it again. Oh, I'm so annoyed you can't pick up any items. Looting enemies is one of the best parts of offing people. And that is ammo for the P38. Okay. Oh, two more. Yeah, again, yeah, this is this is quite quite an interesting. Interesting little game. There's a lot of mechanics with the whole distractions and stuff like that as well, and hiding bodies and that. Objectives updated. Did I say stark holes? Something like that. Holds. Crawl under truck. Are they going to see me? No. Really difficult to see or to tell what the. Uh, the arc of view is going to be. Oh, we can just go around those if we wanted. Anyway, 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 because otherwise I'll end up getting really into this. I need to, um, I will, I'll, I'll do a bit more of this at some point, but I'll leave that there for the moment. It's, yeah, it's not a bad little game. I say I played a lot worse. So, um, anyway, thank you. Let me know if you play this, let me know what you thought of it. And, um, thank you very much for watching. Take care of yourselves, and I shall see you again very soon.